Howdy, ma'am. You ready to fly this here jet? Let's get her done. Sunny Daniel Enterprises. What it do, Daniel Dynasty? We in a new mansion, man. When the queen is asleep. <laughs> Look like he throwing. <laughs> the PlayStation shall be. Let's go, champ. I'm going to have two kids with two different girls. Her booty fake, but it still look good. Wait a minute. I think I just got electrocuted, bruh. Time for that chrono. Why would you call the police? What is he doing? <laughs> the energy he brings is so great. This is where the magic happens. Roll over. Damn. What did I see? Saw two BBCs. And that's a channel strike. I definitely see your channel growing a lot. Would you like a massage? I need a happy ending. <laughs> your cows too, bitch. Sunny Daniel never broke again. Grab number five, number three. Woo! Come on now, dawg. If you played the original, bro, it just hit different. Turn around and get it, son. She thick. Woo! That was amazing. All of those long, hard hours of working definitely pay off. That's for sure. I, I see that. <laughs> I see that. Sunny Daniel Enterprises. What's up, everybody? Today we about to be a fighter pilot, bruh. I don't know if y'all know or not. Probably not. I don't know if I ever said it before, but I used to play this game so much <laughs> with my dad, man, and his friends. I got introduced to Ace Combat on the first one, PlayStation 1. And I always loved this game, man. So I just got uh, Ace Combat 7. It used to be called Air Combat. And I'm going to play it with y'all, man. I haven't played this kind of game in a long time. So hopefully my flying skills is still on point. Background is official, man. That back, Look at that background. I, I changed the lights a little bit so they tick-tock all the way down. It's lit. And then I got those too. But yeah, man, we're going to get into it, man. I got to get back in the, in the groove of recording videos. I played that Last of Us. I'm going to probably still play it. I don't know, though. It, it's kind of boring. I'm not going to lie. Does the color of the sky mean anything special to you? It does to me. It's like a, a hell whole of a story lot. now. When I close my eyes, the sky in my dreams is a deep, dark blue. Pilots have been in my family for four generations. Flying's in my DNA. Even so, my grandpa didn't want me joining the Air Force. He lost faith in the Ocean Air Defense the day my dad died in battle. You know, Abby, I wish you could see what it's like up there. Cruising above the clouds, the dark blue of the stratosphere. Nothing beats being at the controls and seeing it from the cockpit. Look here. Gramps tossed a magazine over to me with an article. Unmanned fighters are no longer a dream, it read. Pilots taking to the skies will soon be a distant memory. A drone action. I don't see anything good coming from that. Know what? Lying smack dab in the middle of the desert west of here, there's a bunch of planes from the last war. Some of them have been mothballed, but most of them are just rusted piles of junk waiting to be scrapped. Gramps was really good friends with the super there, so he got to take whatever he wanted, no questions asked. That's how we got the parts to build our own plane. Now, when I say we, I mean me, my grandpa, and his old war buddies. I cut my teeth working with those geezers. They taught me their skills and some dirty jokes. But with their aging eyeballs and whatnot, I ended up having to do most of the work myself. I was at the airstrip doing some flight training when I saw it. A prototype drone. It wasn't much of a plane, more of a trash can with wings. Laugh at it all you want, kid. But technology's always changing. If you don't keep up with it, it'll leave your ass behind. That's facts. <laughs> That's it took six facts. years and eight months to get that engine running. And it took us another year and a half after that to finally get the balance of the airframe just right. I'd gone from being a little girl to, well, still a girl, just older. But now, I was all alone. <sighs> Wherever the souls of my Gramps and his pals are flying, I hope it's peaceful. That 
Just then, dope. finally, and we, uh... I was ready to break the sound barrier. All this plane could do was take off, accelerate, and fly up. Crazy that they built this plane. <laughs> like, that's insane. It's kind of dope you're a female, too. So I flew up, straight up, through the clouds, high into the sky. Dark blue. I could almost touch it. Then I saw Osea's fighters. They were tailing something. A drone. Damn. They were going full out chasing that thing. Doing 30 G's at least. Damn, I've never seen anything move that fast. It had a rose painted on it. The Erusian emblem. But that country's a whole continent away from here. They shot that joint down. Is everyone here? Settle down. I said settle down. You have all been instrumental in helping to maintain peace in Yuzha as members of the International Union Peacekeeping Force. Until today. Earlier. Our radar site informed us that a group of unidentified aircraft was approaching. Communication systems went down immediately afterwards. We are led to conclude that they have attacked the site. Here's your mission. Man, I used to love this game, man. The ceasefire agreement has been broken for the first time in over a decade. As of today, the Fort Gray's Air Base Squadron of the IUPF has been put on high alert. All members who have been ordered to sortie, fly there immediately. Find the unidentified craft, then use your weapons to round them up and force them to land. If the hostiles counterattack, then you will... What the hell was that? There's smoke! We're under attack. Numerous unidentified aircraft have burned overhead. What? How is that possible? The tank farm in the north has been bombed. Many injured. Scramble. All units, take off and eliminate the unidentified craft attacking the base. This is not a drill. You know, I forgot this game had a storyline. I used to love this game, man. I'm telling you. And it looked like they kind of stayed true to it. Hold up. I can't see what that says. Okay. I probably should take the... What the hell is that? Delete this, bro. We don't need this. I probably should take the little Final Fantasy characters off, but whatever. Start mission. Yeah, let's see if I still got my flying skills, man. If y'all into the airplane game, post in the comments what's your favorite airplane. Mine was always the stealth, man. The stealth bomber, man. The F-14, I believe, was like the best one, though. All right, let's go. New squadron aircraft preparations complete. Stand by at the front. But yeah, I, man, <laughs> I forgot how much I like this game. I hope the flying is dope, though. And I'll probably just make a video, one video of it, because I know people probably like, bro, why, why are you playing airplane games? I don't want to watch airplane games. <laughs> but if y'all do, make sure y'all like the video and comment. Because Radar sight still silent. Scramble. Get those birds in the sky. I do it. What's happening? Bombers incoming. Don't know how many. Let's clear that runway. We don't got all day here. Main squadron, head to runway. Column squadron, take off. Link to Skykeeper. 
Three, Mage Squadron. Trigger your call okay. sign is Mage 2. Verify and read back. Mage 2, clear for takeoff. I don't know situation nothing is about what I'm doing. Okay, I'm cool. Right, cool. I'm gonna turn this down a little bit so y'all can hear me. Do me a favor and get that bird in the air ASAP. Bruh, what the hell is going on? Okay. Man. This looks so realistic now. Looks like the harbor's taking a lot of damage. Can't have any more casualties. Time to stop the bullshit. I used to try to Mage fly two. upside down. Get my flying skills time. back, yo. Roger that. No, four, understood. This is the AWAC Skykeeper. I might want to switch these identified controls, bombers. though. They don't have many escorts. Target they accelerate with R2. The last attack. Expect the worst and stay sharp. I'm thinking square is shoot. Trigger. I'm your wingman. L2, yeah, I know that. You gotta keep an eye out for enemy bombers. High fire. Okay, here we go. Looks like bombers have been located. Bruh, bruh. That was all on me. That was all on me. I thought Square was the missiles. I was about to light him up and then bank to the left, but... Yeah, I kind of forgot what I was... They never told me, though. Warm up with Mage One. Alright, now let me see if I can show y'all what I'm doing. This is the AWAC Skykeeper. I just want to practice a little bit. Take down all unidentified I'm gonna do a bombs. cartwheel. They don't have many escorts. They hit our radars hard in the last attack. Expect the worst and stay sharp. Welcome. Alright, I think I'm good. Trigger. I'm your I just gotta get my eyes Fly together. That's what it means to be in an element. You gotta keep an eye out for enemy bombers. See, when I get like this, I gotta get used to it. Just trying to get my muscle memory down. Because when you start flipping and turning around, it's, it's hard to remember what way you're supposed to be going. I'm making this a lot more difficult than I have to, too, but I just want to get okay, used to it. Here we go. Looks like bombers have been located. It's showtime, Trigger. Let's see if you can handle the spotlight. You're a good pilot. Enemy bomber confirmed down. Good job, Mage Two. Wait, 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 wait. Bad, Mage Two. Trigger, switch your radar. See if you can locate the enemy. What's the radar? Oh, this right here. There okay. it is, sitting there, all pretty, just waiting to be taken. You know, now it's messing me up. I feel like it needs to be invert inverted. I'm tripping now. I need to make up my mind do I want this inverted or not. I think I do actually. If you want to press down to go up, down to go down. Yeah, we leaving it normal how it's supposed to be. But you pull down to go up. Should I fly down some? Oh, they way up. Are oh, these some MiGs? I, I know about the MiGs. About to be on that ass, yo. Get this next joint. Missed. Why wouldn't lock on to that? Yes, sir. Destroy the target. Got my throttle game down too. But yeah, y'all, I want to know if y'all want to see more videos like this. 
I'm just playing it for my own enjoyment. I was about to do it off camera, but I was like, you know what? Let me go in here with my folks. See what they talking about. This game might make y'all dizzy. Right, right. Ooh. Give me all four of them joints. Ooh. It's clean. Honestly, the only thing I gotta get down is my turning. It's a little rusty. I don't know if I'm supposed to be staying with them or not. I'm flying solo. Use this special weapon again, too. Unless that next one is too far away. He might be. Ah, there we go. Yes, sir. You know, it's interesting. How do I didn't even know uh, pilots fought drones, but I forget, man. They got armed drones now. <laughs> so much stuff to go on that just civilians don't know about. Uh, I'm gonna take this out. Give me him, man. Give me him. Oh shit, he on my ass. Ooh, I'm low. I'm high. <laughs> it's so hard to get it. You're bearing sometimes up here in the air. If you're flying the ceiling, I mean the sky is above you or below you. Somebody on me. Special on these. Damn, it's a lot of them up here. Give me one more. Oh, you can follow the missile? I think I remember that in the old one. Damn. I missed. I've got one right behind me. This is page one. I'm spiked. I'm too close to this fool. Oh, he playing uh, games. Man. Okay, you want to play games. I, I play the games with you. You really don't want this smoke, bro. I'm telling you. I'm about to flip this joint around. Watch out. The enemy has a lock on you. Ain't got no lock on me. That's that ass. Shit. He did you have a lock on me. To Gollum and Mage. Job well done. All bombers are down. Our radar shows no sign of bandits. You're in the clear. Or did he? Was that somebody else that shot me? Going, Mage too. Flight Commander looks like he's got what it takes. Let's slow down. It's just one sortie. <laughs> Don't try to be a hero. I'm a little rusty. You make it back in one piece, you hear? Yeah, I gotta side with the boss man on this. I ain't gonna lie, it feel good, Hello, man. Squadron. This is HQ. Did you confirm any drones? What's the deal with all the drones? 
Column 1, return to base and report for debriefing. Whoops. I was just trying to check out the different views. I always like to play this view, to be honest. So I can see the plane I was in. Who is that? Are we flying? Oh, is this a replay? Hey, this is lightweight dope, man. Do me a favor and get that bird in the air ASAP. <laughs> so this be flying. It's a little wobbly, yo. It's a little wobbly. This is dope, though, man. I gotta get the aviators, yo. They're way overhead. Let's go introduce ourselves. I had to get the aviators out, man. I'm a real fighter pilot now, you know what I'm saying? We are currently assessing the damage to the base. We have confirmed that the aircraft carrier Albatross was sunk. We know the attacking bogeys were from Arusha. International Union peacekeeping forced bases all over the Yuzhan continent were attacked in the same way. The damage is severe. Many wars are lost by failing to recover from the opening That's blows. my flight path. That means successfully retaliating was very important. You see that clean ass cartwheel I did? Of battle here. You have our thanks. Look at this. Pop pop. Ooh, that's clean. You see them spiral? I'm telling you, bro, I'm about this flying life, man. And the thing is, is I don't even like airplanes all like that. I'm not really about that life, but in the game, I'm all with it. If y'all want to see me keep playing this, As I will. As of 1 p.m. today, the Kingdom of Arugia has declared war on the Ocean Federation. As soon as the news broke out, enemy aircraft began bombing Ocean territory, causing widespread destruction. The Air Defense Force has released a statement saying this violent attack was carried out by drones. They speculate the drones were secretly transported to Osea in shipping containers and launched remotely. Damn. The Secretary of the Navy has stated that the enemy was targeting naval ports across the country. According to the Secretary, all of the nation's aircraft carriers, including one still under construction, sustained severe damage in the attacks. We have yet to hear back from the department as to the fate of Ocean carriers currently at sea. Hold on, I've just received breaking news. The International Space Elevator, which is being built in southern Yuzha, has been seized by the Erusian Army. Damn. Reports say former President Harling was touring the site at the time, but his current whereabouts are unknown. Our sources in government tell us it was Harling's policies regarding the space elevator that caused economic frictions in the area, and which ultimately led to this war. Located near Erugia, on the continent of Yuzha, the space elevator has been under construction for some time now. The Executive Office of the Ocean Federation has declared a national state of emergency. They have ordered all its armed forces, including Yuzhan peacekeepers, to mobilize and make the necessary preparations to launch an immediate counterattack. Ladies and gentlemen, our country is officially at war. Stay tuned for further updates. Breaking news from ENN. Osea launched an attack on the capital today, striking Farbanti from their aircraft carrier, the Kestrel II. After a brutal battle, the Erujian Air Force successfully repelled them. During the air raid, the Osean Air Force fired missiles at the city and managed to shoot down a number of Erujian fighters. Some of the disabled planes then crashed into residential areas. Bro, I just was thinking, the, the, world was the paint job you used to be able to get in ago, air combat, it was dope. slammed by an asteroid. Yuja was on the wrong side of the planet and got hit. Hard. Refugees swarmed the Erujian Republic, the biggest country on the continent, plunging it into chaos. They were desperate and started a war, one they had no hope of winning. That's the war my dad fought and died in. The biggest nations from two continents went head to head, and the so-called righteous Oceans struck the deal that ended it. They fancied themselves the only nation that could bring peace and stability to the world. 
They even tried saving the Yuzhins, still suffering from the disaster. That's how a space elevator, stretching way up into the sky, ended up being built in Yuzha. Paid for by the Oceans. President Harling said he did it out of compassion for his fellow humans. But to the folks in Erugia, it looked like Osea was moving in to take over. Erugia went from being a republic, back to being a kingdom. When they started this new war, they managed to get the drop on everyone. The second the declaration hit the news, Erugian forces took control of the space elevator without spilling a single drop of blood. Damn. President Harling was touring the elevator when it happened and disappeared. Then, while that was going on, the Erusian ships that were docked all around Osea released a swarm of drone fighters they had hidden on board. Damn, in look at that. No one thought they were capable of doing what they did that day. With pinpoint accuracy, they managed to take out everything that was military, and not a single civilian was hurt in the process. That's Osea crazy. pissed lots of people off with their huge military presence around the world. Erugia didn't have the same reach, but they could hit their targets faster and cleaner. And when all this was going down, I just so happened to be in my flying drag racer. That's how she got shot down. In case you were wondering, yeah, I survived. I crashed in a bombed-out Ocean Air Force Base, then got arrested for breaking wartime aviation laws or some crap. The world went from being at peace to being at war, all in the blink of an eye. It's cool how they got a storyline. Like a deep storyline. Is this like not? Why can't I hear nothing? I was tried, found guilty, and stuffed into a cargo ship. For company, I had some court martialed soldiers. And remember those mothballed planes I told you about before? They were loaded on the ship, too. We headed off down south for several days and then swung east. That's how I got here. I was thousands of kilometers from Arusia, on the opposite side of the Yuzian continent. For a port, it was dull as hell. It had three rusty patrol boats. And the base? The fences were topped with razor wire, the tower had a searchlight and machine guns, and a truck with a gun turret was parked in front of the gate. Its gun was aimed at the yard. <laughs> this was a prison. This place looked like a full-on base, but half the tanker trucks were just big balloons, and Damn. the runways weren't even paved, just painted on the dirt. The whole place was just one big fat lie. That's crazy. The only reason I was here is because they knew I'd restored a supersonic plane. They wanted me to make something out of the mothballed planes they brought that they could park on the fake runway. Can you believe that shit? So. I tried to escape. They found out and set the dogs on me. Eruja has made a declaration to the Ocean Federation and all countries on the Yuzhin continent stationing the IUN peacekeeping force that we are now at war. Right after the declaration was made, surprise attacks began around the continent that have inflicted major damage to our armed forces. Forces aligned with Arusia are currently appearing throughout Yuzha. The combination of these forces has overwhelmed the majority of the continent, and they are now encroaching on us in the east. Additionally, the multinational space elevator has been seized by the Arusian military. After the previous war, the space elevator became both a symbol of peace and a valuable asset in the fight against growing energy concerns. Whoever has control of it will have enormous influence over the entire continent. We cannot turn a blind eye to this critical situation. The Fort Gray's Air Base Squadron has been entered into the order of battle to reclaim the elevator as an advanced element. 
first. You will attack all hostiles coming in the east of Schofield Plateau to stop any interference with the Allied ground troops. The enemy has deployed several vehicles equipped with anti-air radar along the roads. You are to destroy them. They should not pose much of a threat. However, there is a high likelihood that the attack will draw more enemy air support. If that happens, fight them off swiftly and establish air superiority. That's crazy, man. I remember like all the different targets you had to hit. Like sometimes they had you hitting like switch operation area. Oh. Uh, it, it just got deep, man. I'll probably do like this mission and then I'll pause it. Unlock aircrafts. See, this is what's cool about this one. Like, I imagine. Oh, you got all kind of stuff you can unlock. So we had an F-16. Now we can get an F-14. I remember the F-14 was dope for a first for an original plane. You get the MiG-29. I remember the F-14 was the one to get. F-2, I didn't like the F-2. How come they don't show the plane? I want to see what the plane looked like. MiG-29. I think the MiG was a good joint, too. It brings back so many good memories, though, man. Like, I used to play this game with my pops. I watch him play it all the time. F-22. Some of these I remember from the original. Which means these planes have been around a long time. I remember this one with the wings look like they was backwards. Where the stealth fighter at though? Stealth bomber. I know it's in here somewhere. Wait, was that it? Nah. I kinda wanna get this F-14, I ain't gonna lie. Well it's nice to know we can get it. I'm going to probably be doing a lot of this off camera anyway, but I just wanted to show y'all this game. I'm going to finish that Final Fantasy up, though, man. I probably ain't going to be talking much through these. It's a lot of concentration, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get these, get these bogeys, you know what I'm saying? So, there's still military vehicles and anti-air weaponry. Destroy the target. But HQ has made it clear that no harm should come to civilians and no damage is to be done to public facilities. But, uh, any aircraft shot down could land in civilian territory. No point arguing. That's how war is these days. Do you have visual on the anti-air radar vehicles? They should be close. Yep. It ain't locking on, though. Mage 2, locking. Oh, there you go. I'm sure I only need one missile. I hit that manually. Targeting gun range. Hit that too. Target destruction. The radar vehicles been destroyed. We're going for the radar car. They've got their anti-air guns aimed right at us. Extermination. We're being attacked by enemy aircraft. We're using the container now. Firing. I don't know if I got that one or not. Sometimes it don't lock on. I might be too close though. Or too low. It's a possibility I'm flying too low too. Well, this fool shooting at him. I should not have to get that low to hit this target. Look at these flying skills, bruh. Look at these flying skills. It's easy money, but like it won't lock on to the target half the time. I'm gonna hit this fool upside down. You think I can do it? <laughs> it won't lock on. All right, I'm gonna stop playing. Get up off the ground. that and I ain't gonna 
take that. H2, walking. I'm gonna hit him with a cartwheel. Ooh, look at that. Upside down with it. Uh oh, he on my ass. Hold up. I gotta try to avoid this hit. Got out of that too. Where the damn interceptors? I'll try and pop them upside down. Can I pop them upside down? Come on, man, lock on for me, lock on for me. Ooh, look at that. Bingo. Target destroyed. Five to go. I'm gonna follow this missile. That's dope. I need to hold it when I press it. We don't have any engineer weaponry in place yet. We can't put up a decent fight. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go ahead and get over here. Know those was enemies. All right, I got something for that ass. One hundred percent. Where y'all go? Look at this. Got to be careful when you hold that button though, because if you ain't flying right, it's gonna run you right into the ground. Something on the yeah, let me get this. Until mm, so I hit this fool upside down. Yes, sir. I'm telling you, man, I love these flying games, man. Them with the machine go. gun. Continue to engage at your discretion. Enemy interceptors inbound. Prepare to engage in 30 seconds. We'll come. Here they come. Take them down. Okay, recruits. Pay attention to who's on what side. The newest IFF is connected to our entire force via satellites. It's reliable, so trust your radars. They're gonna lock onto that for me. Two targets remaining. It's hard to do that manually, but. Just about to go online. Push the plan forward too fast. The base was too far from Allied territory. Hey. Hold on. Shit. Everything's been burned down. The clouds don't just affect your lock on. The seekers can sometimes lose their lock on to their targets too. Fox two. Fox two. Fox two. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Damn. All right, I'm gonna go this way then. You plan? Yeah, you see his ass playing. He's trying to hit me with the okie doke. I see you. I see you. Hold that down. Almost got myself killed. No, 
know they want me to get the rest of these grounds up things, but they ain't locking on to it. Let's hit that joint manually. I must have missed what the button is to lock on to a target. It might be triangle. Take that chance with that cartwheel. Protect the radar vehicle. Return fire. It didn't connect. Oh, we ain't doing that. Break, break. It is triangle. Oh, y'all shouldn't have told me that. I should not have told me that. Sometimes it's hard because they have a missile on you trying to avoid it, but you're also trying to get your shot off. And you see, I'm flying dumb low to the ground. Know what time it is. This game is lit, bro. I love this game. Give me that, give me that. Page two, walking. Yes, sir. Down. APCs have nowhere to hide. It didn't connect. Locked on bandit. I'm facing up or down right now. Give me that, give me that, give me that. I see you. Yes, sir. That's all I'm saying is video. <laughs> Y'all give me that? They ain't even give me that. Alright, let me get my let me get my my grounds. This is an intense mission, man. Are they about to take off? I don't think so, bruh. Ooh, 
y'all seen that? That was too clean. <sighs> too clean. Whoops. What happened? Status report. Multiple bogeys on radar. They're, you're clear to engage. They're probably hostile. Judging by what the, the hell is these? Are these drones? Well spotted, clown. No doubt about it. We're dealing with UAVs. But that doesn't change a thing. Just think of them as somewhat clever decoys. Take them all down. Damn, they quit. These drones have great agility. All aircraft. You know what high G turns are, Ooh. right? Use them. HQ, this is Gollum 1. Bandits confirmed as UAVs. Repeat, bandits are drones. Gollum 1, that doesn't matter. Destroy all enemy fighters and get out. It doesn't matter? He's saying the war could change in an instant. Get over it. Yeah, I just wish they'd give us a bit more warning. Enemy UAV confirmed destroyed. Hell yeah. Gollum Squadron, you're not gonna let Mace get all the glory, are ya? Three enemies to go. Don't try to read their movements. I ain't trying to, I'm just trying to smack these foes. The enemy knows a few moves, but that's about it. Just chase him down and pull the trigger. I'm buying dinner for anyone who takes down an enemy. That's dinner for me, man. Just too I was lit. I don't know. I was Maybe lit. the bandits we took down caused civilian casualties. That was lit. No point arguing. That's how war is these days. You shoot, someone gets killed. The guys in charge take care of the rest. It's weird probably for y'all watching it. I don't know if y'all can tell how intense it is, but I love it, man. Current target. I love it. This is a really good one, too. It's just like the originals, the ones before. It's just better graphics, which I'm glad they kept it like that. But I love y'all. Let me know in the comments if y'all want more videos of Ace Combat. You've given us air superiority by destroying their radar. Pace. The first